O A T A T A T Hear the word of the Lord. And the more we frequent his presence, the, the more we are, our spirit is getting attuned to his spirit. The more you frequent his presence, the more that your, your spirit is being tuned to the frequency of his, his heartbeat. So it's not just a voice that we are looking for. We are looking to please somebody. We are looking to walk with somebody. We are looking to give God joy with your life. So you don't go all day telling lies, doing pornography, and now you want to hear God because you need to know whether it is Akura you should go or, uh, or Lagos. So God is not a Kalu Kalu God that you play like chess. It's not a Kalu, he's a father. He's a father. So if he gives us the privilege, we can really, if he comes, he's the, we didn't make him father, he made us sons. You understand what I'm saying? We didn't make him father. He's the one that made us sons, that, that decided to, to, to burn us as it were, and, and make us his own. So we relate. We relate. So how do we do this relationship? How do we say we are in the flesh? We have flesh. God doesn't have flesh. God is a spirit. And they that worship him in John 4, 24, we worship him in spirit and in truth. So how do we, what do we do physically? Because we have, especially when you just got born again, or even as a mature believer, we are already in the flesh. We have body. I have a body, you have a body. And most times we have think so much that we are the body, that the body is us. This is not me. This is my house. <laughs> the me is inside. So when I come to God, I have to bring this body, this body that is carrying me along with my reason, my will, my emotions, everything. To relate with God. What we relate with God is in me. It's your spirit inside you that we relate with God. But we have to do something in the physical to connect us. Just like when we want to worship God, we are singing. We have to sing physical. We open and we sing woman's songs. Sometimes we sing, sing in the spirit, but it is still our vocal cords that we are talking by and talking to God. So all those things that we do physically is what we must pay attention to. Nani was talking about uh, increasing our spiritual activities, not religious activities. You can come to church every day, attend that. Attendance is religion. Attention is what is spiritual. Pay attention to what is, is being done, to what is being said, and go and do likewise. Religion is just hearing it. Spirituality is doing it. Is doing it. So it is not about teaching on prayer. Seven point out, seven steps to effective prayer. It is pray. Pray. You, you learn to pray by praying. You don't learn to pray by hearing teaching. You start praying. You start praying. When daddy was teaching Pastor Joshua how to pray, he would take him and say, let us pray. And if he start praying in the spirit, 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, he would tell him to go and rest and daddy will continue. Not sit down. Let me teach you how to pray. You know, speaking in tongues, saying in the name of Jesus. He will know it in his head, but he may never get to pray. So until you set that time apart, like we were talking about before, we set that time apart, and we pray. So you just get there. How do I start? How do I do? You just where I went. You wake up for a Lord. This is your hour. I'm here. We start talking. I'll come your way tomorrow again. And don't forget, read your Bible to know God more.